Welcome to my capstone presentation. My name is Shelly and my main inquiry question revolves around painting on silk and how. This is how to start. Get some materials first, like silk, a pencil, gutta, Chinese brushes, and paint. Add glue if needed. First add glue onto the silk and evenly spread out. Wait till it hardens. Put gutta onto a bottle with a small tip to get some out. Then draw your desired design lightly. You don't want to see your outline later. Use the gutta from before and outline your pencil design. It will prevent paint from spreading. Then use the paint. This is a simple way. It's easy. Some silk paintings have so much detail that it takes some time. Like this one. Back then, all silk paintings were very, very detailed. The emperor had silk painters to paint him. Silk dresses were also very complex, like these ones. Some silk dresses were printed on. Others were made of different materials. Back then, when silk started to become popular, many generations of emperors had worn silk. Women wore robe-like silk. Then they made it complex. Then to what we see today on special Chinese occasions. Now in China, you can do cosplay to look like a royal child from back then. I personally have done this. It was fun. Makeup was important. In China, if you want to do a traditional style, make your skin as white as possible. Then outline your eyes and eyebrows if you want your eyes to be big. So add contacts. Use hot pink or red lipstick. The goal is doll face. Thank you for listening. And for more information, check out my blog.